You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Thanks for stopping by today. I really appreciate it. Now, I had a maker plan, but something came up which altered my course of videos and thought, well, I had these sitting in the refrigerator. Uh, I had done the Lunchables Brunchables. There was two other ones, so I'll put a link. You can see that video. I was missing the breakfast ham and cheese. And then I saw this Lunchables pizza and treatza. Hmm, looked very interesting. You get Kraft mozzarella, pasteurized prepared cheese product, pizza crusts, pizza sauce, chocolate-flavored frosting, and candy-coated chocolate chips, and a Capri Sun. And this one just comes with the little muffin and then your ingredients to make your brunchables. Let me turn these boxes around now. In this video, the first video, I made a mistake. I didn't see that there is heating instructions. Every Almost every Lunchables that I've ever shown has heating instructions. So fun to eat, no need to heat, but you can if you want. To heat and eat, it says split flatbreads, place bottom halves in single layer on microwave plate, build sandwiches however you like using the meat and cheese, cover with tops of breads, microwave on high, 15 seconds or until cheese begins to melt, cool slightly. So I might do that, I didn't do that last time. And on this one, well, you have the box, depending on how the store is going to display it. And then you have all this information here. Let's see, there's going to be heating instructions. I know when I do these videos, everybody tells me, you're not supposed to heat it. Well, you can. If you're at home and not eating this at school, let's see. Fun to eat, no need to heat. And then it says, to heat and eat cheese pizzas, build pizzas, place on large microwavable plate, why a large microwavable plate? Hmm. Microwave on high, 30 seconds, cool slightly. Pizzas will be hot. Adult supervision is recommended. All right, so there you go. What do you think? Let me try the small one first. The Lunchables Brunchables. Now, I think I have a perfect plate that could be microwave. No, it doesn't say it is. So let me just get them out of the package. Lunchables, brunchables, okay, do, 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 do. there you go, there's my ham, and then my cheese, my little muffin, mm, which smells like a wonderful blueberry muffin, and my little flatbreads to make my sandwiches. I will use this plate anyway because I have it handy, so these pull apart. I remember in that video, I even messed that up, so come on. Wow, they're just breaking apart on me. There you go. And then, let's see. Well, let's get this out. Let's build it however you want. So I'll put one ham slice and then two pieces of cheese on top. The cheese goes on top of the hum. There you go, cheese and ham. And then flatbread back there. And I'll build this one here because one I'm going to microwave and one I am not. So let's do this. Let me get a proper microwave plate. I will microwave off to the side. I will not videotape that. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. So I will be right back and I will taste one that's been heated and one that's not. Okay, I'm here. I built this one a little bit different. I put cheese on the bottom, then ham, then cheese on the top. Now, there we go, a little bit better plate. So while that is going in the microwave, off to the side. How long did it say? It said 15 seconds, okay. 15 seconds, one, five, start. Okay, while that is cooking in the background, I will just show you my sandwich, look at that. My brunchables, lunchables, here we go. Ooh, ooh, whoa, whoa, hey, holy cow, that was popping everywhere. Let's see, cheese is melted, top it, ooh, look at that, let me give that a second, I'll have another bite of this one. So there's three versions of this, 
Hmm, let me try to remember. Oh, one was sausage and one was bacon. Okay, this one's ready. So it is softer and more flexible. Hmm. It's like a ham and cheese, grilled cheese. It's definitely better warmed up. Okay, my muffin, my tiny muffin. There you go. A one bite muffin. Very blueberry tasting. Yeah, that's pretty good. I kinda like this one. All right, so that's one snack. I'll finish it. Let's move this one. This one really intrigued me. The pizza and treatsa. Look how nice that looks with the little crispies on top with the chocolate. Who wouldn't want to try that? Okay, so the same heating high for 30 seconds. Ooh, that's going to be too much. At least I can wash it all down with my Roaring Waters Tropical Tide Capri Sun. So I've done pretty much every, not, well, I've pretty much done every Lunchables. I was on a mission way back when, when I was really kicking it to do all different kinds of snacks. And then I stopped. Oh, I wasn't expecting it in a tray like that. Okay. So it's the same crust. For the chocolate and the pizza. Okay, there we go. Mm, I kind of like that side up, but I'm going to put that down. So you get two pizzas and one chocolate one. Okay, so let's make a pizza. I'll move that plate out for the microwave. Okay, remember, you should just be able to tear across. Okay. Oh, I ripped it right open. Mm -hmm. Oh, and someone said in a video when I made the pizzas, it was a pepperoni pizza. Use this, uh, the pepperoni as your utensil for spreading. All these little wonderful little tips I get from people in the comment section. Okay, so I don't have a spatula, so what would you use then? Well, let me grab one. Hold on a second. Now, I made fresh pizzas the other day, and usually I take a ladle like this, and I spread it around like that. Okay, there you go. Beautiful. And you know what you do with that side, but I won't do it with you on camera. Load it up with the chess, lots of chess sunned up. <laughs> I'm going to use all of the chess. It's got some of the candy in it, too. It's cheese candy pizza. <laughs> I want to just dump it in, but with the compartments to wear there. Okay, so there you go. Nice little mess there. And by the way, I think I need a little sip of this Capri Sun Tropical Tide. <laughs> Ah, okay, soften this up just a little. Uh, there's the little tear section. Look at this beauty. Mm. Okay, don't look at this beauty. I gotta get a good squeeze on that. Ooh, yeah. It's, it's an interesting brown. It's not like necessarily, it's, it's almost got like a slight grayish hue to it, doesn't it? Now they have it beautifully spread all over the top. So I must get another spatula. I thought I had everything set. Well, if I was out and about and I didn't have a spatula, I would use this wrapper. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pretend like I'm out and about, I'm eating my Lunchables and I'm making my treats. 
I don't have a utensil. I should just use my finger, but I must stay somewhat clean here. Didn't lose too much. Okay. Very nice. Oh, I don't want cheese on it. Alright, no easy way to do it. Well, I'm just gonna have to go about it. I should have gotta grab the spoon, but mm -mm. Okay, I'm gonna do a little I'm gonna do a little tabletop cleanup. I'm gonna use it all. They're like little M&Ms. They have a kind of nerds look to them, but they're probably chocolate inside. Mm -hmm. Chocolate. Mm. So tasty. Okay, here we go. In my hand. Watch all the cheese. Da, 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 da. There's a lot. Look at that beauty. All right. I will be back with my cleaned up area, a better presentation, and I'm gonna put one in the microwave and try the other two. Alright, nice and steamy. Let's give it a taste. Alright, microwave pizza first. Let's give that a little cut like we're in a pizza joint. Ooh, bad cut. Little pieces. Okay, here we go. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna take it like that. Ooh, it's still warm. Ooh, look at the cheese. I've got a good cheese lift there. Try it. Okay, mm -mm. now I just made fresh homemade pizza two days ago. I make the dough from scratch. So I know my pizzas. This is, you know, great for what it is. And I'm going to eat it anyway. There you go. I like it. Nowhere near as good as my pizza, of course. All right, let's clean up my cutter. Now here is... Ooh, it's not gonna stay. Harder to cut. There we go. Well, let me cut this one just in, in fours. Watch your fingers. Perfect. Here, I'll take a piece like they do on the commercials. A piece of pizza. Hey, there you go. Mm -mm. Definitely warmed up is the best way to eat Lunchables. You could even put those little ones in the toaster oven. All right, so let's see. Let's eat our treatza. I'm gonna cut it just like I cut the other ones. I've cleaned it off. Y'all might be wondering, where does he get such little tools? Well, I have this all from my mini kitchen. Okay. Nice, gooey, chocolatey pizza. Ooh, let's see. Mmm, just like in the commercials. The chocolate has kind of a hint of like a pudding flavor. It's not really chocolatey. Does that make sense? Not chocolatey enough for me. All right, well, while I eat more, yes, I'll finish up my little pizza. And thanks for watching. I'm my pizza. And thanks for supporting the channel. I've had tons of people come back in the channel in the last couple weeks. It's been wonderful. I'm getting close to that 10-year anniversary. It's coming up. I'm working on trying to get my live feed set 
It just so happens that Butch will be here that day. So I hope I can get it to work. I'm running into some technical difficulties. And we'll do a question and answer live. It'll probably be during the afternoon. That's the plan. The last time I wanted to do it, I failed. So I'm going to try it again. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed the video. I will put a link to a playlist for all of the other Lunchables I have shown. Later. If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a Lucky Penny, pick it up.